wearing this pair of sandals reminds me of our childhood days where we just wear our slippers and we just run everywhere and anywhere without knowing what the proper sports shoes is what is up guys i'm desmond here i was supposed to do a break today probably cycle myself and do a short run but it was raining very heavily waited about an hour and a half and it just stopped couldn't be bothered after that so i decided to actually try out a new pair of sandals yeah so in the recent years these uh, sandals have became one of uh, one of the famous or in thing to use for a marathon or a run and it looks like this yep that's what they call the Y sandals and I've seen people wearing it there's actually two school of thoughts one would be shoes are supposed to be proper and we should still maintain wearing sport shoes and there's another school of thought where they go by if there's something innovative and new why not me I was one of those people where we need to wear the right equipment for the right occasion or sport for running I would go for a pair of running shoes but after seeing the craze and the trend it did make me curious whether this thing would actually hurt you or make you feel uncomfortable during long runs or when you hit a very fast speed I decided to put it to a test So this is about a 5-15 minute pace Seems okay But I've just started I actually enjoy running right after the rain because it's very cooling, very windy But your shoes will get a bit wet But for this case, since it's a pair of sandals, it's all good So what I did earlier was I actually ran 1.5 kilometers, about a 5.15 pace and I felt very comfortable because it's very plushy. I, I'm a sucker for, for cushioning and plushiness. I, I do enjoy it a lot rather than the hard or minimal cushioning kind of shoes. There's no right or wrong, depends on your preference and this pair of sandals fit the description plushy, comfortable, feels good but you do I mean that's for me you do need a bit of the toe gripping motion or else it feels like the slipper or the sandal is going to fly off anytime soon maybe I'm not used to it and there are people who actually wear socks with it those finger toe socks they call it the five finger but it's supposed to be five toe socks I decided to just go naked, naked on my foot yeah. and I don't feel uncomfortable as of now it feels great but I'm gonna try and do a, probably a 430 pace just to give it a shot so I can roughly gauge when and where I should wear this when it's a raining weather I would prefer to wear this pair of uh, sandals because your shoes tend to get wet and I don't really like wet shoes because it takes a while to get it dry this would be the best equipment to wear for this particular occasion of course now you can't really see how wet is it because it has already dried up what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna try to do a 445 instead of a 430 because it's been a while and I don't think I can cope but I will still try my best because I want to know how it feels like wearing this during a race and I'm not gonna try it during a race see so here goes
I uh, probably should wear socks because it feels like it's gonna fall off anytime soon. Five kilometer race effort pace and good news I think I've done pretty well for a person who is wearing this sandal for the first time I'm not sure whether you could hear me but if you couldn't hear me I'm just gonna type the subtitle down there and this would be the effort I'm not sure if you can see it and yes, I'm really happy with this sandal. If you ask me whether I'm going to wear it for endurance or long distance uh, run, I'm not too sure about that. Probably I need to get a pair of uh, those five finger socks because it seems like the sandal was going to just fly off when you try to hit a fast pace. Or maybe I'm not used to it. I'm actually using my toes to grip on the sandal to make sure that it doesn't fly off. If you ask me for my opinion whether I would continue wearing this for a run, yes and no. It depends on the situation. If it's if I just ended or if it just finished raining, I will probably wear this because it's easier to clean. Or else your shoe is gonna be so wet and it takes days to actually dry up, which can be quite sickening if you need to use it the next day. Not so fortunate to have a few pair of shoes lying at home. So these sandals would be a very good option. For long runs, I have to try it out before I could give my sincere feedback. As of now, I'm very happy with it and I will definitely use it every now and then. So that's my review for the Y sandals. Hope you guys enjoy it. And by the way, if you guys know where to get good durians, Please leave in a comment below because I'm actually hunting for it. Couldn't really find a place where I could buy those durians. Desmond Fu here, signing out.